Hey guys, this is RCBJ66 as you guys asked for how to make Lego fly. So simply if you have watched the fancy pants video, you supposed to be knowing that I don't know why I'm making it, but somebody asked for it, so I make it anyway. So I got my two picture here. It's so simple and so easy. You got have a picture, you have to have a picture of a Lego flying with a support and another picture with the with the same same angle of camera same light same everything would take the Lego out and just have the background take the flying guys out so you have these two pictures uh, and open both of them with Photoshop CS4 or whatever Photoshop and whatever Photoshop you're gonna be using so takes the time do, 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 do. Yep, yep, yep. So, yeah. Taking this time. Get it on. Yeah, dear the girl coming. Coming, coming. Yeah. Come on, come on. Okay, so we got these two pictures. You should drag both of them out of each other. So we got a picture like this guy is flying with this support right here. And a picture of a background, the same picture with no nothing there. So simply choose that normal tool right there, move tool, and drag the picture with the flying guy on top of the background thing and make it uh, sharp and right yep and then choose uh, eraser tool and you might want to make the eraser thing bigger but whatever yeah, eraser tool and you just simply erase your support like so Trying to get this thing right here. I didn't make the eraser thing bigger because I forgot to able to right click. But whatever, they both work good. So as you can see, all the background is, is gone. Yep. You might get more detailed. As you can see, they're not exactly the same, but it's hard to tell. Oh, that's not a good one. It's not exactly the same. See? The light is not the same because I have problem with light. But, yeah. So, as you can see, there you got a picture of a flying Lego minifigure. Woohoo! So, you simply file, save as, save as desktop is pretty handy and Danny I like to save at JPG AEP whatever and save uh, yeah. that's kind of simple and easy to follow so rate comment subscribe see you guys in the next video